A Montgomery County man is accused of trying to hire someone to kill his ex-wife. He didn't know the person he was trying to hire was an undercover cop. And Doke Enow is the accused, and he has a long record of violence against women. Horace Holmes live in Rockville with the story. Horace? Allison, police say there are many sides to Indoke E. Now, first, there's the man who just earned his Ph.D. two weeks ago, a security analyst at a local tech firm. And then there's the other side that prosecutors revealed in court today. They say he was a man with murder on his mind. This is 38-year-old Indoke Peter Enow. And right now, he sits in a Montgomery County jail charged with trying to hire a hitman to kill his ex-wife. People who live in his Gaithersburg neighborhood wouldn't talk on camera, but tell us Enow had been married three other times and was at the time of his arrest living with his current fiance in this home. Court records show Enow had a long history of domestic violence dating back to 2003, violence against his most recent ex-wife and other women. Well, he's gone through uh, the court system with violating protective orders. He's also had, uh, you know, an assault uh, charge that was uh, levied against him. Um, there's very serious allegations. In fact, in court today, prosecutors revealed in 2011, he now allegedly struck his ex-wife so hard, he fractured her jaw, sending her to the hospital. Then in 2012, they say he kicked and punched and threatened to kill her on one occasion and later violated a restraining order and posed as his ex-wife's employer to try to get to her while she was staying at a domestic violence shelter. Then earlier this month, police say he arranged for who he thought was a hitman to kill the woman. Little did he know, court documents say, that the man he had offered to pay $1,000 for the hit was an undercover police officer. Uh, when you solicit uh, someone to try to kill your ex-wife, uh, that's a very serious allegation, and um, we're just very fortunate that it, it didn't go through. Now, police say after they arrested E. Now, he confessed to the crime. He's being held in jail right now under no bond. Reporting live in Rockville, Horace Holmes, ABC 7 News.